Black Lives Matters 5K takes off in a full sprint tomorrow. Tanisha Crisp and comedian A Train are here to give us the specifics on what people can expect tomorrow. So, thank you guys for joining me today. Proud and thanks Hi, for having Ryan. us, man. So, Tanisha, we've already spoken. We know how you created this last year with an impetus, impetus for social consciousness and that kind of thing. So. We're done with you. We're going to talk to A-Train. He's the one that matters now. <laughs> yeah, since I'm the, since I'm the sex symbol. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Well, I mean, we can talk about the 5K, which involves running, and I'm not going to be doing that. Yeah, listen, but, uh, I ain't running nothing but my mouth on tomorrow, but go ahead. Yes, so yes. There, there it is. So people can come out and run the 5K, but there's so much more going on at the event. So break down that for me. Absolutely, man. They've expanded uh, the entertainment aspect for this year. We have a live band, Eric Carter, and his band is going to be performing on the big stage. We got DJ Oxygen uh, from Bad Boy Entertainment. Um, he's going to be on the ones and twos. We got vendors. Uh, we got vendors galore, man. And so I'm telling you, like, you know what? I see women wearing uh, workout pants, but they don't work out. You know what I mean? So <laughs> it's okay for you to come to the Black Lives Matter 5K and not participate in the race. You can come and participate in all of the festivities that we're going to have, just like you wear your workout clothes and go and get seafood. Go ahead, Tanisha. What should we tell the people? Why did he do us like that? <laughs> well, Tanisha, before you get into your... So what is it for you that you're in year two and it has expanded or evolved beyond just a race. This is an opportunity for people to get together, have a conversation, and socialize. Yes, sir. Yes, it is. Um, this year, we've been very fortunate to partner with four charities, one of them being Soul Spocker, the other being Soberborn, our national charity. Yes. Um, we've been very fortunate to have local families with us. Unfortunately, it's due to circumstances that we would not like to have, um, but the Jordan Davis family will be there and the Trent Fort family will be there. So we are very excited. We're honored that the community supports us and that these families trust us. Hey, Trey, what's it like for you to be a part of something that's, I mean, it's not just fun. It's actually something that has a deeper meaning. Oh, man. It's, listen, it's phenomenal, and I'm really honored, and uh, it's a privilege to be a part of such an awesome event and an awesome cause, and I was so elated last year when they hit me up and allowed, and allowed me to host last year, so I must have did pretty good because they brought me back again this year, so I'm telling you I'm really excited because I'm all for the things that they not only do out front, but the things that they're doing behind the scenes with these charities, these national uh, charity organizations that would be involved. So I'm excited to be a part of it, man. Well, A-Train, I'm sure they brought you back because you are funny. I have seen some <laughs> of your act, but I'm sure also because you're cheap. Yeah. <laughs> my rates went up because, you know, I just dropped my comedy album and it made the top 10 on iTunes. So, hey, man, my rate's going up. So oh, give we'll, me while you can. You we'll know? talk about that another time. So if you guys yeah. want to find out more information, go to blm5k.com. That's Tanisha, right. Tanisha, A-Train, thank you guys for what you're doing for the community. Thank you, thank brother. You. We'll be back with more River City Live right after this.